Hey guys, cool on my back. I'm Rick. Eric. Aaron. I'm Calvin. We are here with Bridgerton. It's very serious. Things have blown up and Boom! settled. Yeah. Mm. Well, well, Edwina like is the... being investigated for being Lady Whistledown. Nope. No. Eloise. Yes. Fuck yes. that Shit. up. <laughs> I was haunted by the kiss you never should have given me. Way to ruin this. I made it better. <laughs> One of these kisses. <laughs> <laughs> you brought it back. Yeah. What were you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sleeping. Dude. You could have one hell of a Kentucky Uno, mule nose. Uno mas. No, I love this. You can actually set your head back. Oh, you know how low you gotta get usually in bathtubs to be able to let your head down or you're hanging or shit? My we head should, would still be hanging we over. We should react like this one day. It's like a hot tub stream. Hot, a hot tub? Yeah. Yeah. I'm for it. When you get a hot tub. And a location. And cameras for it. Set it all up. Right here. Blow up one. Blow up one. I hate blow up one. Four. Four blow up ones. And Aaron oh, each, has to each get our own? Yeah, and it has a leak in it, and has Aaron has to keep blowing it up. <laughs> so the slap bets, we have lap bets. <laughs> oh, I did like. Never mind. I didn't know what we were doing. <laughs> you have to <laughs> sit, sit in the other one laugh. Oh, man. <laughs> That'll be worse. Man, but Richard. Stressful for everyone, huh? First season, I feel like they were already doing it by this point. They were already what? Doing it? Yeah. Doing it and doing it. It's true. It. Wow. Well, this, I think this time was the episode of them doing it. Uh, it was the doing it episode. Mm-hmm. That's not for you. It is for it her. Is. Mm-hmm. Well, it's not her carriage. It's <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm curious to see where this goes. <sighs> Oh gosh! Keep moving, keep okay, moving. The Featheringtons. I do wish you good fortune with all of your things, Lady Bridgerton. All of your things. Mm-hmm. Well, truly sorry, Lady Bridgerton. Come along, Penelope. We don't want to talk the heads off. And she had to write about it because it was the biggest thing. Yeah. It'd be weird if she didn't. You can't not. It'd be suspicious if she didn't. <laughs> you do realize the power you wield in that pen of yours can be used for greater purposes than ridicule and gossip, Mungary. Yes? Lady Whistledown could be a strategic ally to the crown, should she so please. And I would gladly help, ma'am, but I wield no such power, I assure you. So? You would rather be my rival? Have you any <laughs> idea what will happen once I reveal the secret of yours, child? If you do not, then I will deploy my resources to crush you like a serpent. But I'm not whistled down. Do you want to make another mistake this week? <laughs> Lady Eaton. I just heard throw some people. <laughs> Lady Eaton too much. <laughs> <laughs> That'll help We're myself. sitting right there. <laughs> <laughs> another bulb. So that the ton might inspect this wreckage with an even closer eye. A ball may very well work. After all, the Viscount and my sister have been so good at hiding their true feelings from everyone in public this far. It should not trouble them to do the same, Mr. Morgan. Edwina. She's allowed to be a little shitty. Yeah. Newton. Yeah, I, I don't know. Oh, Newton. My apologies. Newton. Newton. Doggo did not like him before. Do you guys' noses like attract each other? Yeah. Get so close. <laughs> Look at him! Was I truly bad? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. If there is so much as a passing look between the two of you, then this plan of ours will be for nothing. Are we all in agreement? So you have to bang before the ball. Of course. It's wrong. Get it out of their system. Quite. It's forbidden. 
it just you makes it more attractive. Can yeah, I know. I know, Eric. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> and then make it any more hot. <laughs> <laughs> They're just turning that shit up. Even the dog likes it. <laughs> yeah. You should stay as far away from Theo and that print shop as you can. You should wait. The lady whistle down the print the next issue. Then with any luck, you can use that in order to prove your innocence. She's terrified and fuming. <laughs> she shouldn't go see Theo. It's wrong. It's for What Eric knew? <laughs> <laughs> he knows what he likes. <laughs> Were you to write something about Miss Eloise, she would never write about herself. Well, I do not need to tell you what that might make the Queen believe. I could never do that. I could never ruin my friend. Oh man, I didn't like gotta that. ruin your cut off a yeah. leg to save the, the yeah. life. Yeah, it's true. Even with all the drama and shit that's happening in the Feathertons. Well, like you write about it. the Theo relationship, right? Mm -hmm. The scandal of that, right? Because she's been hiding it. It must be scandalous. Where does her, her family? Like, about this... the real reason for the breakup, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Is this the party where we just draw naked people? Yep. Where what do these parties happen? One of them. This is work. This might have helped me learn art. You know, I gave up on her. <laughs> Brother, I did not know you'd be stopping by tonight. Neither did I. You wanted to draw a different kind of melons? Is what you're saying? Instead of pictures of fruit. Now remember, before we are to send out our invitations, we must appear to be enjoying each other's company. Shall we? <laughs> She's looking right at me. <laughs> must appear to enjoy each other's company. That's out of the room. <laughs> <sighs> you can't! <laughs> I remember back in high school, we would finish gym class, and when gym class let out, there would be this vanilla smell through the hallway, and I'd smell it. I always tried to figure out who was wearing that smell because it smelled so good. And then Melanie was like, oh, that was like Olive Color Guard. We shared the same one, and we were just oh, all... So that's why I was so strong. Yeah. I could smell all the Color Guard man. leaving. I'm like, if you ever smelled one halls. of them, you'd be convinced that right? all of that was her. Right? What is it? That's why I couldn't trace it, because it was everybody. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, but technically end up being her. <laughs> Do not be deterred. We can put the wedding behind us, so can they. Smile. Opposite side Joke. of the room. Opposite side of the room. Lady Hood, how good to see you today. And you, Lady Mary. And Lord Bridgerton, too. Yes. What's up with Lady Hood? Lady Hood. Give me weird vibes. Seem promising. Someone actually initiated conversation with them. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Mm. Didn't quite just run away right away. Now what's he up to? This is Nobody's his club. Nobody's here. It does seem a problem. He's desperate for a get-rich-quick scheme. Dang it. Everyone wants money. Mr. Modgridge, I bet my cousin did keep a meticulous records of all debts and uh, mm -mm. <clears throat> wages. Uh oh. Mm-mm. I just came across a rather significant one. Yes, it did. I do not wish to defend myself against baseless accusations. And I do not wish you to do so. I respect a self-made man, and no matter what means he uses to make himself. I must know. Are you into fraud? I'm into fraud. Baseless accusations I cannot imagine would be good for either of our businesses. And from the looks of it, you might need all the help you can get with yours. Featheringtons just need to leave this man alone. Featheringtons need to leave everyone alone. Including the Featheringtons. Yep. <laughs> nice to print his gun for the day. I'd have to come back. You... It's not printing I wish to solicit. Fool! This looks even more suspicious. Oh, dear. You can't go there. Forbidden. It's 
bad. <laughs> well, no, if you're found just having sex, then that gets her away from being Lady Whistledown, probably. If we write about it. What is ridiculous is the fact that you thought it wise to come back here again. Yes! Yep! You've taken your pleasure from low life, Miss Bridget, and now I think it best you return to Mayfair before you get me into any more trouble. Put your head back up! Got a bad feeling about this. He's taking her flower crown. It was a mistletoe. No. That's why they were kissing. That's not what it looks like, Aaron. <laughs> you saw up on Lama how happy they once were. What I saw is how even that ended in tragedy. <sighs> happy endings do not exist, Kate. At least not in real life. You need to get her together with Daphne. Go that way. Go, no, that's the don't wrong go that, way. Don't go, go that the way. other way. Go across the room. No! No! Vanilla can't. <laughs> it's bad. <laughs> it's forbidden. Michelle, I've been wishing for a moment to be alone with you. Not here. You're not alone. There's people everywhere. There's nothing to speak about, my lord. We kissed. We did not. Quit whispering me this across the... There's somebody else on the other side of the legs. You should be ashamed of what we did. But you're not. Oh, thank goodness she walked away. She's gonna have to do it, huh? Mmm. But it's forbidden. You can. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there's any other solution. I think it's the best bet you got without outing yourself. I was just telling Lord Featherington that my interest in his mines was sparked quite naturally when I viewed that exquisite yeah. at my brother's wedding. We need a scandal! You make a compelling oh, case, Bridgerton. Uh, allow me to give it some consideration. I shall eagerly await your response. A bigger scandal, right? Yeah. Your exploits, I only wish to be too. Take down your own family. Would Much more willing to do that? She probably is much more willing to do that, right, than the Bridgertons. Yeah. Man. Be a boring job. Stand by a door. Just waiting for someone to come. That's all you do. It. It's you your name, door. too. Doorman. <laughs> it is. Might as well come by it. <laughs> I'm going to confess. What? I know all I need to know about this without I, I shall find a printer, publish a counterfeit paper, and give Her Majesty exactly what she wants. An ally. And you will use the assistance of that apprentice, Mr. Sharp. I do not wish to speak of that boy ever again. I am doing this for my family, Pen. I make the Queen once more our supporter. It will make the rest of society overlook all the scandal we have recently caused. Eloise, I do not wish you to do anything rash. Oh, there is little sand left in this hourglass. If I have to stay in Whistledown, this could be it. It's not only last for so long. You cannot continue lying like that. What will happen? Right? It's like what Anthony tried to do. Yeah. I only wish to thank you for always being such a loyal friend. The honest friend. The circumstances. Never lies. So uh, that's so complicated. Has my interests at heart. She loves her as a friend. She hates her as Lady Whistledown. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. We all arrived at the same time. No one's here. Would you still like us to play? That will not be necessary. <laughs> We're still getting paid. <laughs> I believe the theme you have chosen tonight is harmony. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> they would be right across from each other. Yep. Fire across the room. I don't recognize this song. When I say country, I was thinking like West Virginia. Beer for my horses. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, square dance. I don't like 
Dan Barron needs for Kane. People need to see this. If they rotate, he's gonna, yeah. he's gonna, he's gonna end up with her. Also end up with Edwina. <laughs> <laughs> don't know which one I'm dreading more. Well, yeah, but I think that they, I don't know. I'm gonna show the rotation of the method is. There's a three man, there's a three man group. Yeah. Break the ice for everyone. Ah, uh, we end here. I see. Yep. Perspective. Harmony. Yep. Fine. Awful close! <sighs> Move away. But their noses, Go. man. They just... Like magnets. For she's apparently been associating unchaperoned with improper company. Uh... Political radicals, in fact. You don't want to associate with her now, Queen, huh? No. Seal the agreement with him. Kick them when they're down. <sighs> Man, I fucking hate these people. <clears throat> I hope he was just trying to save her. Where's he going? To find Whistledown. No. Kill her. No. Kill her. Kill, Kill her. her. <laughs> Tells her to a duel. As one makes one's bed, so one must lie in it. Is she done? I don't know. Maybe. Man, it's been a roller coaster. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is he out here too? Probably transforming into a werewolf. Why would that? It's a full moon, Aaron. You know what? Hell of a twist. I believe it. Believe what? He's very hairy. He has a hairy chest. It wasn't that hairy. I've seen hairier. <clears throat> you have been like this from the moment we first met in those woods. Obstinate, inflexible, unyielding to good, plain, common sense. Well, I can certainly understand why that would be so troubling for a man like you. A man used to always getting his way. A man used to giving orders about any. Orders. You give me orders and you expect me to listen. I do not listen. Well, oh, I shall never listen to you or to anyone I wholeheartedly disagree with. Yeah. But the fact it has taken you this long to come to terms with that, to accept that fact. You wish to know why. I am uncertain you even know why. I know why. Oh, here we go. Enthrall me with your self-knowledge and awareness. It is because I've never met anyone like you. It's maddening. How much you consume my very being. <laughs> you lie. Contending with these thoughts of wanting to be nowhere except with you. Wanting to run away with you. Of acting on the most impure. Forbidden. For forbidden. <laughs> forbidden. <laughs> You are a lady. <clears throat> but how I mean, imprinted on my mind ever since the night of Kiss Alfred Wall. You have to stop. I have to stop. There is no other course of action to be concluded. You must stop. It's been you. It's been you this entire time. Spinning my world off its axis, making me reconsider everything I have ever told myself. I love how they change sides. Mm -hmm. Please go inside. He's gonna transform. Don't, 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 don't werewolves. She never does what he tells her. What did I tell you about this? This is reverse psychology. Yeah. So hot. <laughs> yeah, it's a full moon. It's great. It's hairy chest. Oh. It's like a Jackie oh. Chan punch. I think it's the dawn episode. <laughs> Don't stop me now. <laughs> so risky. You're just out in the woods. Didn't think I'd be walking. It's not even in the woods. The wood, well, the, the it's on their land, but. So close to the house, it's in their garden. The satellites. Edwina's gonna come out of the corner. Actually, I realize. Ah! 
<laughs> is there a door in the garden? <laughs> I don't know why I did that. It's the secret garden. Secret garden has a door? The trampoline? No, not community. The movie, The Secret Garden. The book. The book before the movie. I'm gonna take those off. You want me to take those off? They're gonna get grass Ooh. stained what there. We... Doing it, so. Where'd they get the pillow? There's like these little bed things around there, the right? the recliners. Not the recliners, the couches, I guess they're called, right? It's Rick. <laughs> Wait! This is bullshit! <laughs> <laughs> Glad he shaved off his mutton chops. Yeah, hopefully he shaved. Mm. <laughs> All smooth. Oh, Alright, now these kids got this out of the system, everything's gonna be just fine now. They fell asleep? Their whole family is surrounding them. <laughs> <laughs> Holding hands. <laughs> yeah. Why do we fall asleep here? He's a werewolf. He's not a... He woke up coming. He ate her. That would no. be insane, though. <laughs> <laughs> That's my line. <laughs> yeah. What we did was bad. Forbidden. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> but good. <laughs> okay, what now? Eric, you push up your glasses, don't you? Captain <laughs> <laughs> <Up in> Maria! <laughs> oh. I see. Well, how does this work? Let's go. Still hard trying to retain his honor, right? Perspective. It's like, I fucked up. I must speak with Rishon. But she's gone. Not Edwina. Why don't you go back to India or something? That would be real embarrassing if he brings Edwina down instead of <laughs> Kate. Where is she? I don't know. I know Which one? Her. Can you please tell her that I'm here? I'm afraid that's not possible, my lord. They're all gone? She, she doesn't seem to be here. Yeah. One of the horses is gone. She took a ride. I know where she is. In the rain. Oh, fuck. Transform! I love her cloak. Yep. The purple lining. Reminds me of, like the Sanderson sisters. <laughs> what? It's thinking more like Aragorn. Nope, Sanderson sisters. <laughs> oh, please don't get hurt. Anybody riding in the rain? I don't know how dangerous that is. Well, less safe than riding. Not in the rain. Alright. I don't know how he caught her. She truly is the faster rider. She's been circling way. Where are you going? Don't do it! It could be a cliff! What is she doing? The headless horseman. Uh, what's going on? Don't fall off. Don't get hurt. Don't no, get hurt. No, she's falling. Don't die. No, in your head. Ah! Oh, what? Good job, Aaron. No! Why? Wait. Damn it! Wouldn't you have preferred werewolf? If. After their sex night, he woke up covered in blood. That would have been one of the most shocking things I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> oh, it'd be so like good. she's gone and he just covered in it blood. It would have been one of the greatest magic tricks in television history. It's like actually he's been a werewolf the whole time, and then he can go back and like find all the times. And yeah. wolves are like <laughs> deathly allergic to bees in this universe. <laughs> <laughs> the bees. Oh my god. Uh, uh, I did not expect that to happen. It was very. Uh, I just didn't know what was going on in the rain. Some dangerous. It was a very twilight ending there. There was a time when uh, 
the girl. I can't remember their names, but like she. Kristen Stewart. Well, yeah, Bella. Uh, Bella. Yeah. Bella. 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 Yeah. She There's wanted it. to get like Neither. the vampire's attention or whatever, so yeah. she's doing all these dangerous things. Mm. Really? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So it kind of reminded me of that a little I'm bit. I'm familiar with it, but I've never seen them. I've read but Melanie. Some of them. Melanie and her friend would like they would go to the theaters and see them. They were not great. No, <clears throat> they weren't. <laughs> I only know they're hilarious. They are funny, night. especially the green screen scenes of the guy who is a werewolf dressed up in a motion capture suit, pretending like he's a werewolf, which is basically just a dire wolf sized thing, and he's like nuzzling into her hand as she's like petting him. It's the most ridiculous shit you've ever seen. <laughs> like giant fight <laughs> is one of my favorite fight scenes in all of movie history. Ooh. <laughs> I want to check that out. It's terrible. I'll it's, watch it. It's pretty, pretty bad. Good. <laughs> Something. But back to the show. Rick yes. and I Game of Thrones is fight because it was too real and too silly at the same time, <laughs> so it just doesn't gel well. You need to have one or the other, right? Exactly. You're real good or real... Not, I don't know. I think it's better to have that silliness in the middle of it. Like, what the fuck? All right, whatever. <laughs> well, whoever caught it, because I wrote it down, this was the doing it sewed. It was? Yeah. Well, someone was like there. I'm like, that, I think it was this time. But yeah, yeah, I said, like, I'm pretty sure by this time the other two were already fucking. Season two, one, where's my one? Oh, damn, it was last episode. One six was banging everywhere. I was right. One six was banging everywhere. What? What about before that? What do you mean more banging? Pull it out, baby. <laughs> yeah, see, they were banging. I they need, were banging. I need to see your notes. What is that? One six. Uh, on one five, the, yeah. like I look back and the last note I have on the page is "Pull it out, baby." Yeah, the whole thing was like <laughs> my note know. is raw egg plus garlic. I don't know why. <laughs> she didn't know how to make children, and he was pulling out because he didn't want children because he didn't want to be his dad. So they were like having sex for a while, and it was yeah. a problem. Yeah. 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 I don't know. Like, <laughs> I wrote Swish. King George. <laughs> meet your best friend. Meet your, meet your, to meet your best friend, friend and wife. And then I also had like Benedict banged L- Lucy wife. Artist. Banged wife, yeah. Pull yeah. it out, baby. I don't know why I wrote pull it out, baby. I have no idea. Because that was the whole thing. That he was, was pulling out to not yeah. have kids. Yep. And she didn't understand that. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Oh, because he yeah. didn't want to have kids because his dad was dead. terrible. That's right. I forgot. That was like a story thing. He's like, yeah. why is he always doing this? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Pull it out, baby. Yeah, that was in the 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 inn or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. And then the next episode, they were like doing it in every room of the house yeah. or whatever. Yeah, all the time. Yep. All right. Well, the fallout of what happened last time. I mean, I I really liked the, the part where they just decided, you know what, fuck it, let's just dance. That was awesome. Yeah. Like, I legitimately was happy. For that was really it. good. It was, yeah. it was the the good feel <laughs> right mm-hmm. before the... And then Penelope dropped the book. Terrible thing. Psh. Yeah. Like, I understand that there's a scandal. Yeah. But, like, the mom before was so much, like, it doesn't matter what it does to our family, just follow mm-hmm. your heart. Yeah. And, like, marry your love. And now... She's not even like considering that. It's just be. I think it's just because like. But he it, didn't. Do it that. had gone far enough that, like, she was pushing that. That's what he should have done. Mm-hmm. But yeah. instead of doing that, he didn't, and he did this, and then yeah. and then also loved his sister. Like it's turned to a scandal. He, yeah. He yeah. Made a big instead of doing what she said, he before fucking Why? proposed to the diamond the, at the queen. You know, the, yeah. And the queen's like, all right, we're throwing the biggest thing. If he would have just proposed to. Uh, Kate, Kate instead yeah, from yeah. the get go instead of proposing at all even yeah. when, even the day when he proposed to uh, Edwina it would have been better if he would have just proposed to oh it definitely would have been better it would have been a much smaller scandal but it still would have been a scandal yeah but there was I also, think what the mind means point, is like look you know this is good but you know you don't want to have you don't want to fuck up and he's like you know what I'm going to do fuck up hugely <laughs> yeah. and then realize you're right the mom <laughs> was literally telling him go for Kate from the get go don't go for Edwina but Nobody it's, believed instead that he, he was had like, "Well, but she's her. the diamond. That's what I should be going for, and she'll be perfect." And I love his realization of like, you know, when they were both talking about the things that they do. It's like we do everything for our family. Let's just do one thing for us, one. You know, so I, I really like each it. other. Let's do each other for us. Yeah, <laughs> it's a very hot situation. I'm glad for those kids. They're being at the cold moth. Yeah. And now our hot blood is all over, all over that rock. She's not gonna die, right? 
right? People I mean, can die from paralyzed. Less. You can. I mean, that's you can fall backwards and hit your head on the flat I ground know. and die. I Let know. alone falling from a twenty hand horse. Think we're gonna come in the next episode. And she's like, whoop. No, I'm just wondering if she's gonna die. It's gonna be an overboard situation. She loses her memory. Oh, she could lose her memory if she what? She lives. becomes a, a, a handmaid, if a kitchen she, wench. If she lives, though, the thing that comes up maybe Edwina's less mad because you're alive, and I don't hate you that much that I want you dead. No, you, right? Just because you're mad, I feel at like someone. it's a way of maybe solving a little bit of that, probably. And then also he will have to. He might profess more of like, why were you out there? What was going on? You, you know, like. I don't know. He was reaching for that ring. Well, he had he, it. He brought it he with him. He took it. I know. He brung it. There's no reaching. He grabbed it. He took it. <laughs> Give it back. <laughs> I'm gonna spill it. <laughs> Sex time. <clears throat> Man. And then Eloise now has been Eloise. outed. Yep. Yeah. In a manner. And, uh, I mean, Theo wasn't named, but he also was thrown under the bus. Too. Yeah. And, I, you know, his point is... Valid? <laughs> yeah, like she said, like after that scene, he's like, I don't want to speak with him ever again. I'm like, yeah. why? For being so fucking right? You have the safety net of money. <laughs> yeah, he has nothing. He's got nothing. Yeah. Like, your sister's married to a duke. You're going to be okay. But poor Eloise, too. And poor Penn. And poor Penn. She shouldn't have went back again. Definitely not. No, yeah. <laughs> she, shouldn't she shouldn't have gone at the wedding. Yeah. But she definitely shouldn't have gone after the queen was like, what you been doing? To be this- fair. That's this whole show. Oh, yeah. They course. shouldn't have done X. That's humanity. Because it was... That's <laughs> a, this is a story of humanity. Not to hum- humans make mistakes. This is a story of love. Whenever uh, Edwina was like, you know, like, there's no real love story because there's no happy ending. It's like every, every relationship ends in either death or breakup. There's no... Diff- you can't change it, <laughs> you know? Like, there's no happy ending. They can both die at the same time. Death. It isn't death. <laughs> I suppose. Would, is death, death isn't necessarily death sad, though. No, but you're always, it you're always like it. it's always going to end, is what I'm saying. <laughs> like, when she's like, there's no happy ending, it's like, it's so rare to not have something that will end in some type of grief. So rare. Oh, well, yeah. Every story is a comedy or a drama, depending on where it is. Yeah. Right? But yeah, she should have watched last season for happy ending. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Or they don't break. Yeah, you don't come back for season two. <laughs> so there's no drop. <laughs> yeah, you have your happy ending. You leave the show. Yeah. You either now you either, play D and D. You either die a hero or live long enough to see yourself become the drama. <laughs> become the drama. Uh, I but yeah, I mean a show like this, I unabashedly enjoy the drama. Yeah. I, no. One hundred percent. I do. I loved their kiss because they shot it. Like an Asian martial art, yeah, where they had it and then they rewind just before it yep. and had it again, yeah. And the camera guy was like involved in the choreography. He's it's like, also a very he's like, he's uh, in the kiss too. He's like, oh yeah. It's also a very Bollywood movie thing to do as well. Well, it's, it's just it's been so much anticipation, like everybody just screaming at the you know the their their Netflix accounts, just kiss, you know. Yeah. They come in, bam, and then bam. Yeah. Bam. And then bam again. <laughs> and it's yeah. Like, yeah. Bam but, again. Yeah. <laughs> it just made me think of like Jackie Chan, <laughs> or whatever. Oh, Luke. that's what you're talking about. No, man, Jackie Chan punch man, kiss. No, <laughs> man, whenever like, Liu Kang back hits, you know Shao Kahn, yeah. you know, and, and Mortal Kombat, the second one, Annihilation. Annihilation. Yep, that was a three one two. It was. Mm-hmm. You're not wrong. No, it's three two one. A yeah, sham. he's right. That was a three shot one <clears throat> two. Is what I meant. Well, one two is only two shots. A three shot. One as well. Oh, that makes more sense. <laughs> How do you think Colin's gonna get scammed? Um, will Penny find out and stop it? That's so, so, only... so Penn doesn't know about any of that. I don't think so. Right? I okay. don't know how she can. Well, no, no one else. I... Only the Featheringtons, like Lord and Lady, know of yeah. the mines being dry. Yeah, it's like Penn knows that there was a scandal among Prudence and Lord Featheringtons. Yeah, but they don't right? know about the. But they don't know about the yeah the the jewels and stuff. But if she finds out, maybe she can tell him. Sure. Or print it. And he's getting the boxer involved, too. Yeah, Mondrich. Blackmailing him. So shit. Maybe there's a way where you can, like, spin what Eloise was doing as d- trying to look into Featherington business somehow, and she really just burns her own family more. 
you know? They deserve and, it. And clears the name of the Bridgerton, like, yeah. scandal somehow. I yeah. don't know. But she threw away, I don't know if she threw away her pen and burned it as, like, Symbolically, yeah, she's, like I don't want to keep write anymore. this. That, yeah, well, yeah, I don't know if it's like I don't want to keep this because of what I just wrote about my best friend. Yeah, or if it's like I'm not going to be la- uh, Lady, uh, not Feather Whistle Down, Whistle Down uh, anymore. I mean, it makes sense for her to give it up. Like it's yeah. her people she's cared about. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, it started off as fun and now it's gotten too far. Yeah, but and Colin I mean, just keeps saying like, "Man, you're great," and she's like, and "He's like, that's it. That's all I got." Next scene, you know? We gotta wait till next season. Yeah. Well, he's not diving into it. No, I know, but like, you know, like it feels like it's gonna set up for something, but they keep just not doing anything with the scene. I mean, he has... Like Penelope, like, I think one of the reasons she does whistle down is because she herself doesn't get to be involved in a lot of this stuff, right? She's always cast aside, made to wear yellow, and all that stuff. She's also you know? the youngest of the feather. Yeah. She's the youngest. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, like, she has one... The one daughter's already married, yeah. right? And then now the other one's engaged, mm-hmm. and then Penny would be next. Yeah. I, I don't think I could ever get so rich as to hire door guys. I think it's one of the most useless things I've ever seen in rich people. No one has door guys anymore, right? Except for like, well, like a really buildings. fancy, yeah. like yeah. Like, what about if you're paying them like a penny a day? But sometimes no. door guys are also valets. A penny. And no. Maybe these door guys were also the poor penny. The only every time I've ever accepted if they had like armor. And like spears, I think that would be cool. Those are footmen. Yeah, but well, they're guards that also open the door. These guys are just guys who open the door. That's all they do. I don't think they open the door. They just put their spears and like yeah, they cross that. their spears yeah, when you can. I would pay for that. Like the door's locked. Yeah, you get you cross their spears. We take we take everyone who's homeless. Yeah, they need a job. I mean, <laughs> you let them have where like they get bored and food, but they have to be your door guy. Also, yeah. Dude, the, I have so many other things they could do than just open a door when I walk by. There might be door guys but and But get them security. home and food and stuff. What else are you going to have them do? Something cooler. Cooler? Yeah. But they get to wear armor now. Air, air conditioner repairman. That's cooler. <sighs> but that requires knowledge that they may not have. Actually, Anyone no. can open a door. Well, yeah, but we could teach them, and now they can have a trade, and they can... Don't have to be fucking AC guys. If they're repairing the AC, then it's hot. But see, it's a problem. That's not cool. They need to be a heater repairer. That's cool. If you have the idea, that if you have two of them, they can alternate, and then when they're off work, they can go and look for other jobs because they have home and all the stuff they didn't have wherever they were before. But if they're working chair, during business hours, like, they don't have a chance to like do interviews. And shit. No, they have every other day off. Yeah, give them a okay. chair. At least a chair. Stand there all day, like so a that this card? motherfucker doesn't have to do this. You know, <laughs> that's it. That's all you do. You could. It just... takes no effort to open a door. <laughs> it takes I mean, some when your hands are full. It barely Carrying takes your effort. Bags to open and a door. bags of money. They got these white fancy gloves. They can't be touching that stuff. Jesus. You, yeah, because the footmen have touched so it. Dumb. You could just like get automated doors yeah I'm rich I, I mean, can not, get a Walmart door. like a grocery store no yeah. not then I mean now that's why you don't have doormen now because so many things can just there's still a Walmart greeter to for whatever fair, reason you know they like, had mechanisms that you could step on a switch and it would open it we used to have people it. that pressed elevator buttons for you yeah. yeah. Remember the bathroom people? Well, because it's, it's a well, machine. <laughs> it's because they used to just have a lever that's up and down, and you had to line up the floor to before you open the door. Yeah, so there's like a profession. Well, you know, then, yeah. Skilled. And but you point, can't just like have the... some dude doing that and like be well, bouncing the elevator and yeah. lining it up badly, and then and some then, lady slips her leg in there and it gets cut off. As and the door te- guy is no training. As technology, you know, progressed, we we didn't get rid of that guy right away because we're like, yeah. well, that, we've always had him, you know. We, we should keep it. Yeah. Yeah, a door guy doesn't need training. Everyone knows how to open a door. And now we're also helping the homeless community, community be able to get to a place. Why right? do you keep taking homeless people off the street and saying, no, open my doors? Well, Isn't that they a good thing? You can take homeless, homeless people off the it's, street? But it, yeah, that's what you want, it's right? It's not one or the other. You don't only have two choices. You can have them do a bunch of stuff. They gotta stay on you the street. You could. That they can enjoy and not just stand the there so you don't have to open the door. I'm not saying there's not other options. I'm saying here's one for them, and then it lets them have a place and food, and then they can have on their days off, they go look for other jobs if they don't want to be a doorman anymore. It's a step. To be fair, I don't agree with either of you. Fully. You don't agree with me? I don't agree with either of you fully. I agree with parts of both of you, but I like stoking the fire. I'm just trying to help the homeless find something that's not just like living, agree. living under a bridge. And doorman is like an easy job I would think that anyone could do. Like in exchange for room and, and board and, and food and stuff, 
Like, that's a pretty sweet gig. Opening a door. That's all you gotta do. You stand there, someone comes, you open the door. You but go. I agree that a human being should not be reduced to what a, a, a motion sensor and a motor can do, you know? Well, if that's the case, like, there's I'm sure. tons of jobs that we just don't need people for that they're being reduced to. Sure. You know? I agree. And I don't want to be part of that problem. So, door guy. I'm for it now. Just open your own door. Well, I could have. Hey, that guy do something cool, better. Well, like, I wasn't paying him. I was giving him time board and food. worth more than standing there. <laughs> How many times do you open a door? Eric! Like How many times? Eric, what are these people already doing? What do you mean? Where are they right now? They're what standing people? on a corner somewhere. Just let them stand by my door instead. And I give them food and board so, every wait, day. you're saying they're what? already standing there like this. Do it, yeah, not opening anything. There they're not opening it. This. They're, yeah, it's just one little extra step. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> They're already, I hate and love this. They're already standing there. I'm just giving them an extra reason and a place to live that is housed and warm and everything. So You're gonna stupid. hook them up to rickshaws next. What? No. no. <laughs> he's wanting to build a, a, a door guy empire. Is what he's trying to do. And I'm trying. Because your door guy. Yeah. I. Knew I'll lead them all. No. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Guys, thank you very much for checking out this episode of Bridgerton. We hope that you enjoyed the reaction, the discussion, and Jackie Chan Kiss Punch. That as well. We have one more reaction available at patreon.com. One! Da! Well, you had to do it again. Da! There it da! Is. Da! <laughs>